And talking of food, I'm surrounded by it today. <laughs> Are your kids getting tired of the same packed lunch every day? Are you getting tired of making it for them? Today on Coffee Group, we've got mum blogger Claire Deeks and her son, he's five and a half, Dom, to give us some fresh ideas on how to make those school lunches more fun. Morning, guys. Hey, how are you doing, Mel? Very well. Now, Dom, you've already started shaking on your smoothie, <laughs> haven't you? Keep going. Shake harder. Hand on the top. Because we're going to see how we can incorporate that into your lunch. Uh, it can be really boring and monotonous for the kids yeah. and for the parents yeah. as well. And quite often, as a mum, you see all the lunches coming home again. How do you make it fun? Well, I always say it's not always just about making it fun. It might just be making it painless, right, just to get through it. But you yeah. can actually do little things that don't take a long time to make it fun. And, like, one of the things is Dom really likes, if the kids have some involvement in it, it can really yeah. help. And so he is making his shake, which he likes to do. And um, that's a, you know, healthy shake. And what I've done is, oh, you get the shake really? and you can put it in a Kai carrier or any other carrier. Like oh, wow. This. And so this is kind of like the sucky thing that the kids have, but this is reusable. And That's a great idea. You could put yogurt in there as well, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, you can put yogurt. You can put just the only thing is be careful when you freeze it, as I used to do, because then apparently he was like sucking on it for ages. It was like frozen in there. Ah, okay. But you can freeze it to keep your lunchbox cool. That is another thing, but just allow enough time for it to be frozen. Hey, Dom, what do you like the best about your lunches? What's your favourite thing? What are you going for? You like this way there? You like those, so all you like the biscuits. <laughs> That's a sound thing. That would be my favourite thing as well. Yeah. So what so, sort of things have you brought along for us to have a look at? Yeah, so basically my whole thing about the lunchbox is you want to just go with the dinner leftovers, pretty much. And I do a yeah. roast. That's the easiest thing. Or you can test it. I'll just talk to them out. Yeah. So basically what you've got is um, these are leftovers, like leftover sausages um, and... I've got, you know, so you get these little containers, you can put um, tomato sauce. Oh, you can have sauce for your dipping so sausages. So these okay. are little bits of baking I've done that don't have any nuts, because these days you do have to watch out right. about nuts. But these literally took 20 minutes. It's a simple recipe. Um, you can, you know, everyone's, there's no shortage of recipes these days. And it's definitely sort of amping it up a bit from your bog standard Vegemite sandwich, which is what, yeah. a Vegemite sandwich, <laughs> a fruit and a biscuit or something. But, but equally, like, I've got an example over there of like a really plain lunchbox. I think the bento, oh, and there I was just going to say, like, if you just, these are really a cheap option all if right. you want to just get off the internet. So all of these, um, they're a bit of an investment, right? But I've put, brought them along because I think the bento style really, really helps with um, making it easier visually to pack a nutritious lunch, see what you've put in, remember every time. What are your favourite things to put in the lunch that are really easy? Let's take it back to super, super yeah, easy yeah. for people well, like myself. One of my most basic ones Shouldn't is... Shouldn't me say... <laughs> OK, you that say that. my lunch. Okay. Is your lunch, Dom? OK, so what's your... What's your what? What's your favourite? What's your favourite? We've got mm. the biscuits already, and what else do you like? I think Dom likes exactly what's in front of him. Feed Joe. <laughs> yeah, I'm a big Feed Joe yeah. fan. Fruit, okay. Obviously, yeah. in the lunch. Yeah. What do you like? Obviously, in the lunchbox, um, fruit is easy. But the other thing that's <laughs> so a simple idea that lots of mums have done is these egg rolls, and you can do them either as an egg roll or as egg sushi. So basically, make an omelette, couple of eggs, crack it in the pan, flip it over. No, you know, cordon bleu chef required, yep. and then Good. roll it up and either just cut it into a roll or cut it like this, which we call egg sushi. Lots of kids love that, but you can make it fancier like you can actually put some mayo put some spreading you could put some seaweed in there right um all sorts of things you've got the yogurt and the blueberries obviously olives if your child was an yeah, olive lover the olives some there's some broccoli um yep exactly easy steamed veggies that's the steamed corn really there's nothing that's too hard here in the plastic bag what i've got is some apples and over there they're not brown apples what that is that you can see in the lunchbox that far one is that these are um i've put cinnamon so it covers up if there's any brownness okay and then, and eat them. then they won't know you know if it's a little bit brown because it's got the cinnamon which is sweet as well and there's some really good ideas there claire you know what it's, it's obvious stuff but when you lay it out in front of us it actually seems so much more obvious <laughs> um i will be making my school lunches tonight for my kids as i always do <laughs> and they will be getting a step up from their normal sandwiches i can tell you that hey you yeah. guys thank you both very much for joining us today <laughs> Dom, you've got all of this food to eat for your massive lunch today. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much as well. <laughs>